Hey there everybody and welcome back and thank you for coming back. Alright, today I'm going to bring you uh, Nautica from Chaos of the Velocitron box set that was part of the um, Toys R Us exclusive. Um, and she comes with her little Headmaster Parasec. A little Top Master is what they're called. Uh, so yeah, there they are. Look at the little Headmaster first. And yes, I was correct. She is, it is a female character, so that is cool. So there you go. No paint on the eyes. Same old, same old. This is a retool of um, Blur, so not I'm not you know it's not gonna be very long. So there you go. Nice paint job on that face. Look at that. Looks like I'm gonna say bluish greenish eyes. Probably looks like that. Some yellow for the head crest, yellow right there, silver paint for her face, or kind of a whitish paint. That's a nice head sculpt like that. I like that. It's a lot of paint on there. And it comes with her little rifle. Just like blur, but it's pink. So. Alright, let's take a look at this little figure. Okay. Like I said, this is retooled. They just added some like a turbines or whatever. This little part right here. So it's basically the blur, blur mode with these little wings on there. It looks good. A lot of pink on there, some yellow paint everywhere looks good where the paint is it looks good uh, a little chipping right there maybe oh, that might be just dust or something oh she's got some yellow right there for the thrusters so she's painted up decent she's got you know it's a lot of yellow to her but a lot of pink to her like the autobot symbol a little top master can sit in there you know just like normal so yeah there's you know nothing to brag about, but it looks pretty good. I like that. All right, here he is with Crapagonics. And she's, um, yeah, she's about the same size, same length as the uh, Crapagonics uh, spin out. So good. All right, and there he is with, there she is with Blur and Brainstorm. And the weapon, I forgot to mention, does stick on the front like that. So there they are. They look pretty good together. I like that. That pink really pops. I think that really, you know, with the yellow, I think it really pops like that. It's really good. All right, back from transformation. And there's this beautiful lady. Looks good. So, the head, you already saw the head sculpt. Looks good. Look down a little bit. All that good stuff. I'm not going to go really through a lot of uh, articulation. It's the same thing as blur. So, you know. Does have waste for a lot of good stuff. So, you know, decent kind of range. It's got some white paint up here. Like I said, the yellow paint and some white paint up here. These do come off. They can pop off a little bit. So you can take them off if you want to. You don't have to have them on there. So, that's good. She can, This is a shield that can come on, you know, it can attach there and all that stuff. I just leave it in the back. So, she does have a little backpack with that thing back there, but you can take it off. And uh, she cleans up pretty good. So, yeah. There she is with the blue paint down there. Looks good. It's a lot of paint for this. Yeah, there's some scratching on my yellow. That's unfortunate. But, you know. Oh, well. So, set her up. Right here she is with the brainstorm and blur. So, you can tell there's some good retooling for this one. And a little bit of retooling for her. Uh, but it is the blur mode, so. But they look good together. I like this mold. All right. I don't have, there are no other Nautica um, figures. So I thought I'd, you know, bunch her up with a bunch of uh, other female characters that I have. You know, you have the RC, Windblade. Uh, that's RC, I guess. Chromia and Black Arachnia and the Nautica back there. So they look really good together. I like that. All right, final thoughts. Uh, this is a good bot. I like it. I like the retool. I love the you know the colors on it. You know, the yellow pops. Um, you know I like the mold. The blur mold is pretty cool. It's one of the, I think the first Titan Returns I bought was a blur mold. I think. So yeah, I mean this is a good update, and I, I'm glad they're you know touching up on some female characters. You know, so I'm you know I'm really happy with this one. Uh, the paint on it is really good. You know, there's some scratches on the yellow. Um, I think they did good on the yellow. Like I said, yellow is hard to uh, put on, you know, other, you know, colors or plastic, but um, it's really bright on this, and, uh, but it is a little, some, couple scratches here and there. Uh, that's not, you know, the toy's fault, it's just, you know, the way it's been packaged or something like that. 
Uh, the weapon is, you know, same as Blur. You know, it's just a pink one. I wish they would have put some paint on it. That would have been cool, but they didn't. Uh, the materials feel good. You know, it is Hasbro, so have no complaints. Uh, like I said, the paint is, you know, really good. You know where it's at. There's actually a lot of paint. You know, with down down there and yellow. You know, so it breaks it up the sculpt. I like that with the kind of lighter pink on the plastic. So it breaks up the sculpt, and I like that. I like that on the transformer. Transformation's easy. You know, it's a tight return. So you know, another thing. So articulation. Eh, you know, it's is decent. It's not the best, but you know, it is a little deluxe figure. They're all on ha on ball joints and everything. But you know, it's alright. So I would probably give her eight Hill Hasbro's, eight and a half Hill Hasbro's. You know, she's a good figure. I like that. So I'm gonna get on the floor, do a little floor time, and uh, why don't you come down there and be my neighbor? All right. All right. Not much of a skit today, but I just want to talk. Um, ask y'all a question. Uh, y'all want to see more female characters? I do. I mean, I, you know, I love RC. It's, you know, it's a good character. You know, and um, can't wait for MP. Uh, the fans' toys is coming out. I wish Masterpiece would do an MP of her. Long overdue. But I wish they would do more female characters. There was a leak on uh, the Hasbro stuff coming out with the new Power of the Prime, so there's more female characters coming in. That's cool. You know, even if they make up some new characters, that would be awesome. I mean, you know, give them a little, give them a little fiction or something. But I think this Nautica figure, you know, is awesome. I'm glad that they uh. Included her in the um, box set and everything. So I like this. I guess we can kick the crap out of a uh, Mirage. Oh. So, it's always good to kick the crap out of Goodbye Wars Mirage. So yeah. What do y'all think? Uh, hit me up on the comments. You know, do y'all want to see some more female characters? You know, still RC. You know, like I said, I like her, but you know, it's time to get some more. You know, you know Windblade's coming out. With stuff you know they got chromia you know make us new female characters it'd be cool if you know got a lot more female characters i would like that so yeah eight and a half uh, hill hasbro's definitely the set is expensive um, but i'm sure you can find um they split up the set on you know ebay or whatever on the boards on facebook and everything cybertron cafe shout out to those guys on there um yeah so i'm sure you can find her for cheap you know 15 20 bucks so i would definitely pick her up she's a She's a good bot. I like her. So yeah, hit me down in the comments. Hit down that like button. Give me a thumbs up. You know, share all of my stuff. Uh, sub subscribe, you know. Do all that good stuff. It's free. Won't hurt you. Couldn't find a face on her. Sorry, there's not really a face on her chest, so. Oh, well. <sighs> all right. Well, don't text and drive. Not worth it. Uh, thank y'all for um, watching my review. And, uh, hell has bro. Good night, folks. Mm, hell has brown. Good night, folks. Mm.